guys hey what is up um today i'm gonna be talking about my two new little family members my two new little boys that i got i think two weeks ago yeah from pokey pets in kenilworth um so yeah let's get into this video so my names are tom and jerry and yeah the reason i can tell them apart is because Jerry has like a little bald spot on like the back of his neck that he had like since I got him. He's like more calm, more chilled, more tame in a way. He more affectionate. He's a little bit more like laid back, like he just goes with the flow kind of thing. And then Tom is a little bit more like schizo. He's quite nervous. He doesn't like to do new things. And yeah, he gets a lot of frights like all the time. But I think they've both kind of bonded with me now, so that's nice. They are so sweet. They always sleep in their tube, like always. I've been trying to get them to sleep in their house, but they always just want to sleep in their tube. So whenever I get them, I have to take out a piece of the tube and get them out that way. But they have been become like way more friendly and chilled. And oh yeah, I was going to do a little, a little haul of what I got for them. And... So, first things first, this gigantic ball that is bigger than the size of my head, and it is huge. But I was worried that they weren't going to be able to push this, but they can actually push it, which is crazy. So yeah, it's just a ball. It came in a box that looks like this, and I think it was... Yeah, it was 232 Rand. It's quite pricey, but I mean for the size. It actually has screws, which I didn't know that it had to have screws. Um, it came with the screws, so totally fine, but I mean, like, wow, that's a sturdy ball. And yeah, so I put one in at a time just to see if they could do it, and they liked it They liked it a lot more than they liked the smaller ball. I think it caused them a lot of stress because it was just too small. And yeah, and then eventually I put both of them in just to see, like, what would happen, you know, like, just to see. And they actually worked pretty well as a team, like, they worked pretty damn well so they could move it they could push it and they kind of learned that if they were on two separate ends it just wasn't gonna work but yeah next thing i got is some straw because when i got them two weeks ago i used the last of my straw i don't know if you guys remember i had a hamster called guppy but he was a dwarf hamster and now i've got teddy bear hamsters <laughs> i also got some of this it's like cotton wool what is it it's um snuggle nest safe and comfortable nesting material non-toxic vegetable based colors so yeah it's for guinea pig hamsters and rabbits but it's, yeah it's just it feels like really weird like cotton wool in a way but like not it's like yeah so you just break up some and just put it by their house and hopefully that'll make them go into their house because it is just not happening snuggle nest cotton was 45 rand so that's not too bad also got some joy and fresh it's strawberry hamster bathing sand which looks like this which looks quite interesting so it is a deodorant antifungal refreshing scent and bite dermatosis yeah i don't know but apparently it keeps them nice and fresh and yeah this was 27 rand i said i could either put it in like a tub and they can like roll in it and clean themselves or what you could do is go and pick up a toothbrush and brush them with it because you also have to brush their hair which is very hard so i got this like zero to three year old toothbrush and it was only 10 rand so i thought why not let's just get that because i don't want to use like one of ours i might have toothbrush on toothpaste on it oh yeah i cleaned their house today because it was a mess so their house at first looked like this and then I gave it a little clean and it finally looks nice and clean like this yeah when I put them in I tried to get them to go into the house with the, the cotton wool but alas they went back into the tubes but maybe they will go back into the cotton wool who knows while we're on like a haul I also got this this advent calendar which is a 
it. It's a JT1 advent calendar, so it has like beauty products in it. So I'll be unboxing this gem in December for you so you can see what's inside. It's not related to hamsters at all, but I also got this fluffy blanket. I'm obsessed with blankets at the moment. It's quite a big like blanket, but nice and soft and small-ish. And this was only about 66 Rand. It was on sale, so I thought, why not? Let's get it. That's not related to hamsters anyway. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed my little haul and meeting the two new additions, Tom and Jerry. And yeah, I'll see you guys next week. When? Uh, I'm so used to saying that. I'll see you guys next week. Oh yeah, I don't know if I mentioned this, my uploading times are either a Saturday or a Sunday. It depends like when I can get it up. So I try and get them up on either a Saturday or a Sunday. More often it's a Sunday because I edit on a Saturday and then I work during the week and blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe. Please like this video and have a good day.